one thing that's very useful to do is to provide a breakdown of animals or people by some sort of characteristic, whether it be gender, type of animal, why they came into the vet, anything. We, want, we might want to know um, how many or what percentage came in for each reason. Now, to do this, I'm going to create a frequency table, much like I did in Unit 1. I just, the only difference I'm going to do is I'm going to end up converting these to percents at the end. Because we want to know not just how many males and females we have, we also want to know what percent of the animals were males, what percent were females. Maybe that, percents are easier to compare, so maybe that will allow us to compare to other, other vet offices or other days, because this is just one day's worth of data. So the first thing I want to do is set up my frequency table by saying it's, I'm going to do what gender, and then what percentage of each. And we have two genders, males and females. And I'm going to have Excel count these up for me. So I'm going to use a formula to do that and insert a function. It may be one you've used recently, but it is the count if formula. And so I'm going to, you could search for that, or they're in alphabetical order. I'm going to find that somewhere and hit OK. And I'm going to choose the gender for the males to be 0. That's my criteria. In my range, I highlighted the column I wanted it to, to, to count up. And I'm going to do that one more time. Now it's right on the top because I just used it. Highlight the gender column because that's the column I wanted to count. And now females are coded as one. Now this gives me what we call the physical count. Nine males, 12 females. Let's say I want to turn that into a percent. That's easily done by just clicking up in my formula bar and just adding, if I click on the cell, up in my formula bar, I could just add divided by the total number of animals. In this case, there are 21 animals that came into the vet's office total. And I'm going to do the same thing again for the females. Divide by 21. And you're saying, well, wait a minute, those aren't percentages, those are decimals. Excel will calculate this and turn this into a percent for me. I could highlight what I wanted to turn into a percent for me. And in the Home tab, in the number part of the ribbon up on top, it's, it's formatted as a general number. Well, I can hit that percent sign, and it's going to turn it into a percentage for me, just with one click of the button. And now I have a nice table that I can, again, format by adding some borders in there, because borders do tend to make it look a little bit nicer, and copying and pasting that over to Excel, or over to Word. And this is just the same Word document I've been, I've been using for all of my examples. And that'll paste in nicely. So there's my breakdown of animals by percentage.